I mean, why do you produce a strategy to 2025? Um, is my answer to your question. You do that because you want to people to get to lift their heads, look at the horizon, see what the opportunities are, and make decisions in the short term which will have tremendous implications in the long term. That to me is the key. You know, that's why you you know because who can predict what's going to happen in the world in the next seven years? No, nobody can predict anything with any great degree of certainty other than general growth and so on. Um, but we clearly know we have a product here. It's in our DNA. Tourism's in our DNA. It's the single biggest indigenous sector we have. So if there is a recession coming in the next 10 years again, as is probably likely when you look at the cycles, um, wouldn't, you prefer, wouldn't you prefer to have the most broad-based, best-serviced um, uh, industry with the capability to be nimble and flexible as it might need to be? I mean, that really is what it's about. So we just need to get more focus on ambition. And the industry has work to do as well. We, we need to improve our digital skills. We need to improve our language skills. Uh, as we broaden, you know, the, the, the tourist, um, uh, the tour, the tourist that we want to get um, from from in terms of diversification. So, if this is a two-way street, it's both for the state and for the sector. Yeah, and I suppose value for money is is, is, is critical. And it's it's you know we talk about new hotels in Dublin. I mean th that added competition actually helps the value for money um, 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 initiative. Um, so I think that's particularly important because there's 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 there's, there's there'd be nothing more dangerous than being complacent. And assuming that this growth will continue into the future, the industry has to, as, as Mara said, remain very, very responsive and agile. Uh, but equally, we, as a, as an industry um, representative group, should be demanding more of state and state agencies to get behind this sector because there's vast potential uh, into the future. And it's jobs. It's a very labour-intensive business, and you could have another fifty thousand jobs in this sector over the next seven years, which, which, which is good for the economy and for the sector as a whole.